you don't have to know a lot about these gels. I know they can be kind of confusing when you're looking at all the colors and what the heck do they do. Don't think about it that way. Think, I want to pretend that the sun is behind them. So what color is the sun? Orange. So I'm going to use an orange gel. And if you want to be more technical, this is a full CTO. I'll pop it on. All right, so now that we have the gel on the B1, we're just gonna turn it on by holding this button here, and that's it. We do have this channel set to 3A, which is what this transmitter, this basically just talks to your light to tell it to fire at the same time that you're taking the picture, is also set to three, channel three, and we're good. So Amy, what you're gonna do, because we want this to mimic the sun, right? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this light, we're gonna put it behind them. Now, I wanna make sure that it's also like behind the trees here so that I can get that nice warm glow on the sun as well. So let's just put it like just back there somewhere and I'll kind of look through my look through my viewfinder to see where it'll look good. I think it's gonna end up looking good probably all the way over there. <laughs> I always send my assistants out like, <laughs> really far distances. Keep going. Right there, that's perfect. So the idea is that I don't see her and hopefully I can let the light come and just, it'll hit them, but it'll also hit parts of the background because when I light up the background, it's just gonna make it look again, more like my style. I like a bright background, so that's perfect. Now, I have my transmitter here set to TTL. So all that means is just auto. It's just auto for your light. So my exposure hasn't changed. I haven't done anything else. I have simply turned on my light and I said, hey light, do what you need to do, do what you do best. And Profoto has this kind of legendary TTL that's just amazing and pretty much gets it on par all the time. So let me just retake that exact picture. Look nice. And we're gonna test. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. <laughs> I love it when my lights work. So now you can see it's very, very subtle. You can just see this beautiful light on Brooke, nice rim light on Tyrese, and it's also lighting up these parts of the background. Now the best part about this, I love the light that's coming down out of, out of my, my flash. I can hit TTL and quickly change it to manual. This holds the power that it determined it was gonna come out, and now I can just tweak it up or down. Could I use a light meter? Yes, but is this faster? Yeah, it is, at least for me. And fast is key when it comes to weddings. So now that I've held it, I can move around and do a whole bunch of different things. So I'm gonna take a couple pictures. Look at each other, guys. And I'm not concentrating too much on posing them right now, but oh my gosh, look at the light that comes behind them right there.